Oh, yeah. The lowest home run you'll ever see. We played enough BR runs to get a flawless, non-sellable pack. No, we did not get flawless yet, but we will this year, I promise. I'm going to work very hard to get a flawless and get multiple flawlesses. Because, let's be honest, if you guys want to complete the live series collection, you got to play BR. As frustrating as a game mode as it is, and as I personally don't like it much myself, um, it's just it, rage-inducing. You got to play to get these live series cards. But at the very end of it, even if you play enough and get enough XP, you get a good pack anyway. All right, you can't sell one of these guys, but you might need them to put them on your squad, especially right now in the season. All right, we took Joe Maurer. We're going to put him in our lineup in the two spot. We're going to hit with him. Let's just jump right into it. All right, I'll show you my squad. I've only played one ranked game this entire year. It's not been recorded, not put on YouTube, but we won three to one. Take my word for it. And uh, like I said, Joe Maurer behind the dish, Harper at first, but I could sub him out for, uh, you know, put JD Davis at first and then put Vlad, this nice Vlad Takashi Okazaki card in left field. Not great fielding in the outfield, but, you know, we're going to have to manage. Got Tatis at short live series, Chase Elthey at second, Francisco Lindor at shortstop, and he's going to be leading off for us. JD Davis, a BR god right now in left field. Byron Buxton in center, Giancarlo Stan, another BR legend right now in right field and then tony clark everyone seems to be doing well with him he's in the cover off the ball for every single person that's touched the controller and hopped into mlb the show 24. all right willie castro very good card as well um the numbers don't look great he plays above his uh stats there let me get my face out of the way he plays above his attributes on this card juan soto and then vladdy like i said and then this lou gehrig we got as well pitching is not gonna be terrific we're going to have to manage. Martin DeHigo has kind of been sneaky good for me. And I think a lot of people have him. Um, or at least realize they should have him if they haven't gotten a decent pitcher yet. Sandy Alcantara and then Robin Roberts, Zach Gallon, and Justin Verlander. Some live series guys. And then I think about it, I'm probably going to take him out for George Kirby just for the velocity. Bullpen, we, we got these. Got these goons down here. We're going to have to work with them, all right? It features, you know, Andres Munoz, Emmanuel Clase, Billy Wagner's better than I thought he would be. Uh, Kenley, Pete Fairbanks, Ryan Helsley, and then Devin Williams, all right? Uh, here's the lineup. If you want to look at it, pause, whatever. Let's get into it. All right, now, the game just came out today for everyone who didn't buy early access, so there could be a bunch of newbies on the game. This this guy has actually a really good... I forgot to pick out the Hassan Kim. I'm an idiot. There's a free pack in the marketplace. You can get Hassan Kim if you didn't know already. I messed up. Um, whether it's been BR or ranked, man, I've been playing at MLB stadiums pretty much every time if I'm not the home team. So surprisingly, they're not playing bad right now. Kind of smooth. I hope uh, I hope it stays that way. Dog shit against righties. Get down the line. Lindor. Whoa. Okay. Did anyone see that? curve and then curve back towards the fielder i've seen it curve and then straighten out but not like curve and curve back like a freaking boomerang that's a good swing but i know it's an out i already know it joe mauer gets hoed on his first at bat one ball no strikes i'm pretty sure this is on veteran man i gotta play some more rank to get up there like you would think that's not gonna go Oh, no, it is. I didn't think 92 off the bat would leave. One down for Stan. Yeah, this could be a bloodbath or a very close game with a lot of scoring. Been smashing the ball lately. BR. So we are ready for this, and Tony Clark is more than ready. Boomba. Baba. Free cuts are always a movement. I saved so much money when I was cutting my own hair. But I found a really good stylist, and it's my friend's sister. Game two coming up. And the good thing is we still have Sandy. Still got Sandy cheeks in the rotation. And that wasn't a dig at Sandy Alcantara. I feel like every barber I've ever had, haircut, stylist, whatever, and I haven't had many, they've all been like super happy with their, their lives. I bug her when she gets in. It's nice how uh, these MLB stadiums are like half full right now. I wonder if they'll change that when the season starts. Is that gonna drop in there? Nope. Man, everyone's playing at MLB stadiums. Come on, get down. All right. All right, Joe. That's a gapper. Are we going to score on that? I don't think so. He's cutting that off. And I got to stay at second. 
that one out scaring me. I don't want to run through a double play. Don't ask me why I have the Twins jersey on. We'll just say it's for Gomes. Oh, yeah. Tony Clark is a perfect, perfect machine right now. Come on, clutch up, Ellie. Chutley. Chase Ellie coming in clutch. Let's get him. That's a good throw. Oh, my no, God. Thank you. <sighs> Everyone looks so weird in the, the Twins uniform right now. I'm not a Twins fan or anything. Go! Hug the line, baby. J.D. Davis. Bomb! The exit velos this year just... Man, tickle me pink. I can't believe I just said that. Game three? I don't know, Nuggets. Let me change that. Ooh, what, dude? The Iron Pigs and Bacon USA? Ooh, this guy's only got a lot of golds. He's got like three diamonds. Let's take advantage. What time of day did you pick to play this game, man? I bet he did uh, default, like, June month. Default for the month and then made it like 4 o'clock or 7 o'clock. Hmm? Oh, no, he's got the 90 version. Hey. Oh, he still throws gas. What? What collection card? All right, well, O2, oh, you know, you gotta swing a ball like that. Oh my god, was that on a screwball? I missed that. I just straight up missed it. And he's trolling. Well, let's teach him a lesson. Maybe it is, I don't know. I just don't troll in general, because I don't want to get humbled. Oh. Get enough humbling in real life. Uh, I have a feeling you might get this one. Nope. Buxton to Buxton. I cannot believe this Griffey has like 70 something speed. And it's a Mariners card. Wasn't he always fast on the Mariners? Um, I can't really see that because this guy... Oh, I think we got it. He's so tall. And handsome. Mm. He's going to pay for that one day. Shit, too. Can I get a second? Good pitch. That's perfect swing. Oh, it's going to go. Okay. It was deserved. I was like a teeny tiny bit late, but... Check that, man. I'm right on it. Take it. 2 nothing. Live series, Bryce. Oh, man, I just missed that one. That shouldn't really be a home run, but we'll take it. See, here, here's the thing. I'd rather have Willie Castro batting, but I got I got my DH with Tony Clark, and so I got to have Harper at first, and Willie Castro has blown so many plays for me oh. in the field during BR runs. I, it, I'm not even strength. kidding. Like three or four plays where he just dropped a ground ball, and it could have been a now double play. And uh, I just had to take him out for fielding purposes. But he was killing the ball, so I put him in DH. I don't know. Really good swing on a good slider. It's all right. We get three in the inning. There we go, Lindor. Yeah, cash is just... Nice. Dude, my, um, I got two nephews. They're both twin boys. My older brother and sister-in-law. Sister-in-law. Uh oh. Zing! Tatis got a good arm. Here, I haven't heard of him. Tony! He doesn't even need to put the bat on the ball to hit arm runs, man. This dude's insane. He had a 99 last year. No one was using him. Did they, like, change something about him this year? You know what I mean? I feel like, uh, but a lot of streamers were... Into... No, I do understand that. No, ball four. That's a strike. It's like, why do we play this game, you know? Damn. I freaking pushed that. Try to win. Good pitch. Get out of play. How is that staying in the play so long? The one guy I faced put up 11 in the first, and he was raw. The second guy, um, he scored like 8 in the third, but... It no, no, don't let a ball that far. Oh my God, what is happening? Hey, you're late. I've seen it all. 
Three. Oh my god, he golfed at that one. JD. Alright, we had one of those against him too, so. Not that I feel bad or anything. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. The lowest home run you'll ever see. From the debut boy. Mr. Bacon himself. And he's the closest MLB player born to Canada, probably. Besides people actually born in Canada, so the bacon is fitting. Oh. I'm trying here, I'm tr guys. I'm, Counts one and oh. Might be a reach, but th there's something there. Bacon, Joe Mauer. Hey. You know, I'll take it. Get up the middle. Ooh, we didn't dive. Ball right. four. Take your base. Ah, that's double play. Out. Out. Good swing. That's me now too. The late to make no system in place. There's my YouTube. I have plenty of videos on different stuff in there, like tutorials and stuff, game modes. Um, but dude, this year's game is great. So you play tw 22 or 21 a few hours. Okay, so I start. I got back into it in 21. I would rate 21 was a good game. 22 was one of the worst copies of the game in a while. 23 was a major improvement. And so far, it seems like 24 is even a little bit better than 23. So it's going in the right direction and it's looking pretty good. It's, it's a good year to get back into the game for sure. And next year should be better too when they make it only on one next ball, gen. Two strikes. I love the just bald eagle screams randomly throughout. Dude, I don't, I don't know how to put a 12 curve in the dirt. People will say like, if I make a good swing, I want to get rewarded for it. Like that, that was actually a really good swing. Ow. In real baseball, that doesn't happen. My opinion on that is video games, if you're a user playing a video game and you put a good input into the controller and the game, you're doing the best you can, you're using your skill, you should get rewarded because that's what video games are all about. Baseball video games, if it's a true simulation game, that's just different, you know? You're gonna make good swings and get out, but you can't be you can't be upset about it. You just have to realize, okay, I am good enough to hit that pitch. So when I do it again, it's gonna it's gonna be a home run next time, you know? Instead of a line out. You just gotta, you know take your losses, choose your battles and So it's hard, but you like I, I want it to be hard. Challenging video games are fun. I like that, that's I just wasn't no ready for that at all. Strikes. Plus Byron Buxton's swing. He's got a long swing, so it's kind of slow. Ball in. But I would totally understand if you didn't ah. want to buy the game, that's a good pitch. If you're frustrated about those things, like it feels like the same game. I I, I think those, those opinions are very valid, but it's not like everyone has all the time in the world to play this game. The people who are really good at this game play the game all the time. I don't know any casual players who are just raw at the game. See, that was a perfect swing. Literally perfect. And it doesn't bum me out because I'm up 7-1, but if I wasn't, I would be a little bummed. That shit happens, though. That was a that was a good swing, don't get me wrong, but the other one was better. So, stuff like that can happen. Pitching's frustrating because the other your opponent will get fluky hits. You just gotta remember all the times you get fluky ones, too. It's gonna suck. Piss rockets and... Let's go to second there. And just hard line drives, you're squaring up the ball, you're doing everything right at the plate, taking the pitches you're supposed to, waiting for years, hitting line drives, and then it just goes right to their fielders anyway. And then on the other end, you're pitching well, he's swinging super late, not even on the ball, and getting hits and runs. And like, that literally is just baseball. You gotta laugh, laugh at it sometimes. Oh. I think SDS does a good job of not making this game pay to win. Are there some paywalls? Yes. So don't fly off the handle when I say that, anyone who's listening to this on YouTube. Um, it's not pay to win. I, you can put a, get together a super competitive and really, really, really good team without paying any money. Yes, in-game money. Without paying any in-game money other than just buying the game. There are stubs, but in this game, stubs are super easy to earn and flip in the marketplace. I know people who... They find ways to earn millions of stubs. There's roster updates. You can literally invest in players as if it were a stock market. If a player is doing good in real life, like Lindor last year had an incredible year, but he started out with a lower rating. If you bought a bunch of, yeah, I'll take the friendly man. If you bought a bunch of Lindors and he was when he was cheap, 
they do the roster update you update the game get the live series download and then he's going for like thousands of stub more if you bought like 50 of them for really cheap by just playing game modes you get stubs from just playing the game and then you can buy Lindors and sell them you could easily make like 300,000 stubs which can get can get you some of the best cards in the game all right well we had a couple of bad at bats with Jim Auer in the second game but he did hit a perfect nuke probably the lowest line drive home run I'll ever see at Laughing Mountain Park or any stadium for that matter other than the Costco and uh we had a nice little couple games with him six at bats hitting 500 he had that nuke all right like I said um he's gonna be a stud so until we get a better catcher man we're rocking with Joe Maurer for the foreseeable future all right and guys I got a lot coming this year if you want to see me do more of a certain game mode whether it's offline grinding and stuff mini seasons I'll do those tutorials showdown how to draft BR and all that um I'll upload some BR gameplay for sure we're going to try to get flawless obviously going to keep doing ranked seasons but guys let me know in the comments don't be afraid to, to comment down there um if you're normally not a YouTube commenter like it just break through that wall it's it's more fun to engage with us um so I can get the videos out that you like and that I like doing because I like doing all types of videos um for whatever you guys want so I like every game mode in this in this game for the most part all right but good debut and uh we'll try to debut someone else when we get a, a better card for our ranked seasons won a couple games today and uh, keep moving up the ranks all right so check out the the rest of the videos I got hitting tips videos out I'll do pitching tips next and I will see you guys on the next one